So ito yung ating uh, second example for the cables and arches. So yung first example natin is cable subjected to point load. So yung second example natin is cable subjected to distributed load. Okay? So determine the maximum and minimum tension in the cable and also the tension at the lowest point of the cable. The girder weights 3 kN per meter. So ito yung ating girder. And ang weight niya or bigat is 3 kN per meter. Okay? So ang gawin natin, uh, ito yung uh, ano natin, tension at A. And ito yung ating tension at C. And yung ating lowest point of the cable is nakalocate sa point B. So hindi natin alam yung location ng ating point B. So isolve natin yung kanyang distance from support A. Okay? So this is 20 minus X. So punta tayo sa segment AB. So, ito yung ating uh, segment a, B. Okay. Ayan. So, ito yung ating distributed load na 3 kN per meter. Ayan. So, ito yung ating reaction at A. Ito yung ating tensile load at B. So, this is distance X. And ito ay 10 meters. Okay? <clears throat> so, mag-moment tayo sa A. Summation of moment at A is equals to 0. Clockwise is positive. So, positive yung ating 3 kN. So, 3 kN per meter multiplied by X multiplied by X over 2. Okay? Then yung ating TB minus TB multiplied by the height na 10 meters is equals to 0. So, TB is equals to okay, 0.15x squared. So, ito yung ating magiging equation number 1. Equation number 1. Okay. So, punta naman tayo sa segment BC. Okay. So, ito yung ating segment BC. Ayan. So, this is 3 kN per meter. And this is, this distance is 20 minus X. And ito naman is 7 meters. Ito yung ating TB. Ito yung ating reaction at TC. So, mag-moment tayo. Sa C. So, summation of moment at C is equals to 0. Clockwise is positive. So, positive ang TB kasi clockwise multiplied by 7. Counterclockwise naman ng 3 kN. Multiplied by 20 minus X. Multiplied by 20 So, 20 minus x over 2 is equals to 0. Okay? So, ang TB natin dito is equals to okay, 0.214 multiplied by 20 minus x squared. Okay? So, simplify na natin yan. 0.214 